Tidbit Tuesday. Did you know that dehydration is essentially a state where the body lacks sufficient fluids to carry out its normal functions effectively? It occurs when the output of fluids, primarily through urination, sweating, breathing, and bowel movements, exceeds the intake of fluids. This imbalance disrupts the body's electrolyte balance, particularly sodium and potassium levels, which are essential for various physiological processes. In adults, the severity of dehydration is contingent upon the degree of fluid deficit in the body. It's estimated that around 75% of Americans are chronically dehydrated. Signs of dehydration and severity levels 1. Mild dehydration symptoms include thirst, reduced urination and sweating, dry mouth, with children defined as losing 3% to 5% of body weight due to fluid loss. 2. Moderate dehydration symptoms comprise more intense thirst, infrequent urination, dry, sticky mouth and mucous membranes, fatigue or weakness, dizziness or lightheadedness, headache, decreased skin elasticity, and rapid heartbeat, with children defined as losing 6% to 10% of body weight. 3. Severe dehydration presents with symptoms like intense thirst, minimal to no urination, dry, parched mouth and mucous membranes, profound fatigue or weakness, severe dizziness or lightheadedness, headache, sunken eyes, very decreased skin elasticity, rapid heartbeat or palpitations, confusion or irritability, and fainting or loss of consciousness, with children possibly losing over 10% of body weight. Ways to treat dehydration include 1. Water, the simplest way to rehydrate and replenish lost fluids. 2. Electrolytes, oral solutions or sports drinks restore electrolyte balance. 3. Hydrating foods, fruits and vegetables high in water content aid hydration. 4. Diuretic avoidance, limit alcohol and caffeine to prevent dehydration. 5. Rest and cool, resting in a cool environment reduces fluid loss. 6. Oral rehydration. Or tea replaces fluids and electrolytes, suitable for mild to moderate dehydration. 7. For fluids, healthcare professionals administer intravenous fluids for severe dehydration. 8. Monitor and prevent. Regular fluid intake and preventive measures maintain hydration levels. Remember, the choice of treatment depends on the severity of dehydration in individual circumstances, and seeking medical advice is recommended for severe or prolonged dehydration. Check out our blog for more information.